Hey, what's going on today, guys? Today I'm going to be demonstrating an iron rig I recently built. It consists of four GTX 1660 Ti's. They're all by Gigabyte, and they feature Samsung memory as well. They're the OC edition. Basically, that means it's going to be mining Ethereum very efficiently. So anyway, uh, I'm happy with how well it's heating this apartment. And in addition, it's a complete silent operation. For example, that fridge over there is, makes even more noise than this mine right here. Anyway, without further ado, hope you guys enjoyed my video. Thank you. So right now I have the mining rig located in the corner here. It's a good spot because the window could be opened up right there for added ventilation. In addition, there's an antenna for the Wi-Fi connection right there. The thing I like about this rig for Wi-Fi is that it can be mounted anywhere where desired as long as you have a Wi-Fi signal and a wall plug right there available. So right now the four cards together are on Phoenix Miner and combined they're at 109 mega hash per second on average under thermal throttling. As well at the wall it's drawing about 361 watts. That's a ratio of 0 0.29 which is actually pretty good because these are budget cards. And as well to help achieve that, I'm using the Corsair AX1500i power supply. For those of you who don't know, that's one of the most efficient power supplies you can get on the market. Right now at 120 volts, it's running at 94% efficient. That's phenomenal for a computer power supply. I mean, most run at 80% max for efficiency. And the other cool thing about this power supply is that the fan on it doesn't actually spin until it goes to around 800 watts. And with these 1660 Ti's, they're so incredibly efficient that like I said, together they're only drawing 361 watts at the wall on average. So right here for my hard drive, I have it on an SSD. And the CPU is an Intel Cellular on dual core. I really like that CPU choice because with the dual cores is drawing minimal power. And as well, it only requires a passive heatsink to keep the CPU cool. Because of course with mining, it's only intensive on the graphics cards right there. So basically all down below here is no moving parts. The only moving parts are the two fans on each of the cards right there. So in order to achieve these really efficient numbers, I'm using a program called MSI Afterburner. I'm just going to open it up here. So yeah, I have the power limit set at 70%. And then the temperature limits is set to the max. That's just because it can get quite hot in this room sometimes with the sun shining in. The core clock is set to negative 250. That's because when you're mining Ethereum, it's primarily utilizing the memory. And then I put the memory clock to plus 350. That gives an extra average 2 mega hash per second for each card. I know you guys are probably thinking I can probably achieve upwards of 0 0.35 mega hash per second per watt at the wall as long as I fine tune the voltages and do overclocking a bit more. Uh, however, my main objective with this rig is for stability. In other words, I want to run for upwards of six months at a time without touching it. So I realized what I have it set to now is a good balance between longevity as well as efficiency over the long term. And then the fan speed is set to 60%. I feel that's an excellent balance of having a quiet operation as well as having good performance. And with the fan speeds at 60% right now, each of the cards are averaging around 60 degrees Celsius. So yeah, I have five PCI slots on the motherboard occupied. Uh, four are going to the car, then one to the Wi-Fi adapter. Eventually, I do hope to expand a bit, but right now, obtaining these GTX 1660 Ti's is virtually impossible with, with the skyrocketing price in Ethereum. Anyway, guys, thanks a lot for watching this video. I had a lot of fun building this rig, and I'm really hoping to use it in the years to come to hopefully get an ROI and as well heat this apartment nice and efficiently. So yeah, I wish you all the best luck in your future mind building. Goodbye now.